Okay, this one is on uh, prototypes not possible. Uh, reason why is when you think about it, <laughs> it's kind of simple. I'm from the future. Um, my SIC hasn't been invented yet. Uh, you guys have SSN, social security numbers. They're numeric. That's it. But over time, there's only so many numbers left. And uh, in order to get a job, you know, you have to have an SSN to begin with. Um, in the future, mine's called an SIC. It's a social identification number. And it, again, it, it, in the future, you're going to run out of numbers at, at a certain point, and they're going to go alphanumeric. So when you start off with your, you know, groups of like three numbers, two numbers, and then four, they're going to start with the very first one in the first group. After a while, when they run out of numbers and they're, you know, just numeric, and they're going to make alphabet out of the very first number in the first group of three. And then you've got all these extra numbers now that all start with like A, and then all the numbers you can recycle through that. I think they, they tried to recycle them at the beginning, but then records were getting mixed up because somebody else had had the SSN before, and it just didn't work, so they went alphanumeric. So anyway, my SIC hasn't been uh, invented yet. <laughs> so imagine how hard it is to get a job when nobody knows you exist. You don't have any proof of an SSN. I mean, it's, it's, it's just really not possible. So consequently, I have to take jobs that are I get paid under the table, or they just kind of overlook the fact that I, I uh, it's that I don't have an SSN and they'll just, you know, keep me on the books as long as they can, but then after a while, when they go to report, they have to either say, oh, it was an oversight, sorry, to whoever they're reporting to, and I have to find another job. And people have been nice enough when I first got here in this time period, they put me up with a place to stay, and, and I've been getting menial jobs here today, but you really don't make a whole lot when you don't have an SSN, and it's not as glamorous as TV makes it out to be. Um, I mean, I don't can't think of much else to say about that. So making a prototype for me is not possible on, on the ideas. And people keep asking me, oh, why don't you make a prototype? Because I don't have any money. <laughs> I've said that since the beginning. I mean, you can't hardly get a job or you get jobs that are um, menial. Uh, if, if that's the correct word, what the heck, I just, I don't care. I, I, this has been tough enough being here. It really hasn't been great for me. Nobody's really like saying, oh, you're from the future, let's make you a star or anything like that. I mean, it's not like you see on TV. It's, it's not like that. Um, so money is scarce. I'm barely making it day to day. I've been here long enough. I wish somebody would just come back and pick me up and take me home. So there you have it. I mean, if you guys don't do it, then it won't get done. And, like, if you guys went back... Uh, a couple hundred years, or think of it even a thousand, and try to explain to people what you've seen in this time period, unless you had the basic engineering skills to actually produce the materials to make the, the primitive tools that can make the newer materials, that can make the more uh, better tools, that can make and use and find the new materials to make the better tools. They could find the materials to make the better tools and, and so on and so forth and just keep progressing in a very, very short period of time. Unless you actually could were able to do that, you're kind of stuck in a situation like, gee, I don't know, me, where I can only explain on, on this what I see. I've got this cheap little video camera and I'm trying to give you guys these things that I've seen in the future. So. I, I really would like to go back anyway. That's it for now. I'm getting depressed.